everyone, my name is Beaker and I'm a fear buster and this is the fear busters lab and I'm so glad that you are here. The team of fear busters works hard every day to bust away fear with God's word. So you can be sure that there's no fear in here and I like to help all of my friends even when they are scared, especially my monster friends like we have here. So all of my monster friends, we've got Bobo monster right here. And we've got Bebo Monster right here. And also Zingo Monster. And Mimi Monster. But don't worry, these monsters are my friends and they get scared sometimes just like you and I do. So I'm here to help you guys bust your fears too. Do you guys wanna be a fear buster with me? Great, before you get to work, you need to know two lab rules. Rule number one is be kind. Can you hold up one finger and say be kind? Good job, you guys. You can be kind by staying quiet so everyone can hear. And so that we don't wake my pet snake Buster. He's sleeping right now. So if you can be kind by staying quiet, let me hear you say shh. Perfect. Okay, so there is one more rule in the lab, and that is that we have to be safe. So you can hold up two fingers for rule number two and say, be safe. Awesome job, you guys. You've got it. So we can all stay safe by sitting in our spots and keeping our hands to ourselves so that they don't distract us from listening. Perfect. Here in the Fear Buster Lab, I like to say a verse from the Bible to help me remember that there is no fear in here. If you're ready to be a fear buster, then stand up and say this Bible verse with me. Ready? I prayed to the Lord and he answered me and freed me from all my fears. Psalm 34.4 Good job, you guys. Now, you guys may be wondering what this stuffed animal is doing here. Well, I just wanted to make sure I was ready in case anything happened in the lab or in case anybody needed help. Like, in case I found someone who was scared, then I could use this cuddly duck to help them feel better. You know, fear busters are always prepared. Anyways, now let's worship and sing together. When we pray, our God hears, sets us free from all our fears. When we pray, our God hears, sets us free from all our fears. We're not scared. Sets us free from all our fears We're not scared No, no, no Are we scared? No, no, no We're not scared No, no, no Are we scared? No, no, no I gotta get the wiggles out of me I wanna hear the story, it's gonna be fun Cause hearing about Jesus is for everyone So I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me I wanna shake my hands, I'm gonna shake my feet I'm gonna shake my head, gonna groove to the beat Cause I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me I said I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me Wiggle, 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 freeze! Wiggle, 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 freeze! I said I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. I 
gonna shake my hands, I'm gonna shake my feet, I'm gonna shake my head, gonna groove to the beat, cause I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. Oh, I said I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. Wiggle, 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 freeze! Wiggle, 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 freeze! I said I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. Skiddly scat, skiddly dip. I gotta get the wiggles out of me. I wanna hear the story, it's gonna be fun. Cause hearing about Jesus is for everyone. So I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. I said I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. Oh, oh, I said I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the wiggles out of me. Take it down and freeze. Fear Busters, it looks like Bobo Monster is having a roaresome day. His meter is bright green. If our monster friends are feeling scared, their meter is really red. Fear Busters, can you point to a monster meter that looks really red? You're right, that's my friend Mimi Monster. That means that she is really scared. So let's send our fear-busting field agent Lou True to help Mimi Monster. All we have to do is take out our button and press it. Are you guys gonna press it with me? Ready, just hold it out just like this in your hand. And on the count of three, I want you to press it. Ready, one, two, three. Boop. Hey there, Fear Buster friends. I'm Agent Lou True, ready to bust some monster fears with God's Word. Fear Busters, do you know what God's Word is? The Bible! Right, Rooney! Hey, Fear Busters, I think I hear something. Let's go check it out. <gasps> I'm really scared. Agent True, is that you? It sure is, Bebo. What's got you so scared? I was really sleepy, so I closed my eyes to go to sleep, but then it got really dark, and I got really scared. Oh, Bebo, I'm sorry you were scared. The dark can feel scary. It's something a lot of people fear, but I want to help you bust that fear. We can do that with a story from God's Word. Bebo. Would you like to hear a story from God's Word? That would be roaresome! We monsters love to hear stories from God's Word. Fear Busters, do you like to hear stories from God's Word too? Yes! Great! Then let's all put on our gazing goggles. Zoop, zoop! One day, Jesus' friends saw him praying all alone. They asked him, Jesus, will you teach us to pray? Jesus was excited to tell his friends how to pray. Jesus said we should start our prayers by telling God how much we love him. Oh, I can start my prayer like this. Dear God, I love you so much. That's right. Let's see what else Jesus said. Jesus also said that when we pray, we can ask God for what we need. So I can finish my prayer to God like this. Please help me not be so scared of the dark. Amen. Sounds like a great prayer to me. Whenever we are scared of the dark or of anything else, we can bust that fear by praying. God will hear us and give us exactly what we need. Sounds great. When I'm scared, I will pray. You've got it, Bebo. Fear Busters, repeat that after me. When I'm scared, when I'm scared, I will pray. I will pray. That's it. Well, I think my work here is done. Fear Buster Field Agent Lou True, over and out. Fear meter is
is green now. That means that she, she is not scared anymore. Oh no. Now it looks like Bobo Monsters, Bobo Monsters meter is really red now, and that's not good. So let's check back in with Agent True and see what Bible story will help Bobo. Just hold your button one more time, and ready? One, two, three, boop! Hey there, Fear Buster friends. I'm Agent Lou True ready to bust some monster fears with God's Word. Fear Busters, do you know what God's Word is? The Bible! Right, a Rooney! Hey, Fear Busters, I think I hear something. Let's go check it out. I'm really scared. Agent True, is that you? It sure is, Mimi. What's got you so scared? I do not like storms. I do not like them at all. The rain and the thunder scare me so much. Oh, Mimi, I'm sorry the storm scared you. Sometimes storms can sound scary. A lot of people feel scared during storms. But I want to help you bust this fear. We can do that with a story from God's Word. Mimi, would you like to hear a story from God's Word? That would be roarsome. We monsters love to hear stories from God's Word. Fear Busters, do you like to hear stories from God's Word too? Yes! Great, then let's all put on our gazing goggles. Zoop, zoop! zoop. One day, Jesus said to his friends, let's get in the boat and sail to the other side. So they got in the boat and began to row on the water. Let's all pretend to row like Jesus' friends. Row, row, row. Again, row, row, row. Riding in a boat sounds fun, but I'm always too scared it will storm, so I have never been in one. Boy, did we pick the perfect story in the Bible to read together. Let's keep reading. Jesus had been teaching all day, and he was tired, so he lay down in the boat and went to sleep. Friends, can you pretend to sleep like Jesus? All of a sudden, the wind began to blow really hard. Then the waves started splashing so high, the boat was about to sink. Oh no, oh no, I can't look. Agent True, you know I'm so scared of storms. Mimi, Jesus' friends were scared too. They ran to where Jesus was sleeping and shouted for him to wake up. They were scared the boat would sink. Jesus woke up and said to the wild wind and waves, be quiet, be still. The wind and the waves went away. The water was calm and quiet. Jesus asked his friends, don't you know that you can trust me? As they sailed away, Jesus' friends were not scared at all because they knew that they could trust Jesus to take care of them even in a scary storm. When you are scared, you can trust Jesus. Last week we learned that when you feel afraid, you can pray. When we pray, you can ask Jesus to help you, and then you can trust that he will take care of you. Wow, when I'm scared, I will trust Jesus. Let's pray and tell Jesus we trust him, like we're learning today. Say it after me, dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. I love you. I love you. Please help me. Please help me. I trust you. I trust you. Amen. Amen. That was a great prayer, Mimi. It looks as though my work here is done. Fear Buster Agent Lutru, over and out. Wow, trusting Jesus totally helped them bust their fears. Everybody shout this with me, ready? Fear busted! I have to tell you guys something. 
I actually had this duck with me because I was afraid of falling asleep and having a bad dream. But now that I can know that I can trust Jesus, I can send my duck bye-bye. And when I'm scared, Jesus will help me bust my fears. So I'm gonna put my duck in my fear busting box. Just get it on in there. Fear busted. And now you guys can put your fear in your fear busting boxes as well. Well, oh, I gotta go you guys. But will you guys try to be fear busters this week too? Awesome. I can't wait to see you guys next time. Bye.